Good evening, sir. Good evening, ma'am. Now. Good evening, Manjeet. Manjeet, you were not present in yesterday's class. Yes, sir. Call the exam site. Uh, speaking? Yes, sir. Okay. How was it? Good evening, Ritika. Kaisa wa, Manjeet? How was it? Okay. Oh. This I will talk about uh, course uh, program live. Okay. Sports program. Yes, sir. Okay. Good evening, Sananda. Okay. Um, today we have a plan. We are going to do a reading, open reading. That's the plan. Okay, we'll do some words till students join. Um, okay, spectacular. What does this mean? Spectacular. Sorry, can you repeat that? Your voice broke up. I couldn't hear you properly. Okay, Harvinder, I'll share that. Wo videos ni share hue. I'll share the videos today for the last two classes. I'll ask ma'am to share them. I've done them. I did them yesterday. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, so, spectacular means... Okay. Uh, and coca koi word. Someone can tell me. Uh, uh, we have this. We have. And coke English care. Someone tell me. I told you the Hindi word. What's the English word? Deepak. And coco kya kehte hai? And coco. Yeah. What was it? What's it called? Spectacles. If you don't know what it's called, spectacles. So it's called unimaginable. Spectac okay, spectacular is unimaginable. Yes, you're right. But the word it originated was from spectacles. Spectacles mean something that is worth watching. Spectacular means something which is worth watching. Worth watching that you must watch. So so big that it's worth watching. So that's how you got spectacular. It was a spectacular, worth watching. It's called amazing also, sir. You tell like amazing? Yeah, amazing. Yes, amazing. But I'm telling you this, the way to remember it and how it originated. Yeah, no. Sure, 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 sir. Fine, okay. fine. Okay. So it comes from spectacles. It means something which is worth watching. Success. Okay. Um, let's go. Spin-offs. What are spin-offs? Rotation. No, not up and down. No, not up and down. Okay, so spin off is like um, an additional benefit that that was not your intention. So I did something and so I got another benefit. So that's a spin off. So, for example, I did this for demonetization, was done for this purpose, and some other benefit happened. That's the spin off. Spin off is another benefit that was not intended that you get from something that's spin-off okay santosh there's a bit of disturbance i'm going to mute you you can unmute yourself when you want to ask a doubt okay let's go um sorry i wrote something so else. can you please repeat the meaning of spin-offs spin -off. okay i'll do what will will search the meaning it's better
an unexpected but useful result of an activity that is designed to produce something else. For example, I did something, my expectations were something else. I did it for some other purpose, but an unexpected benefit that I got from it, that's a spin-off. So for example, uh, demonetization was done for curbing black money, but it also, let's imagine, let's say, uh, it also impacted terrorism because terrorists couldn't use that money. Then that would be the spin-off. Spin-off is something a benefit that we didn't expect. We did it for some other purpose, but that's a you know. For for example, you're preparing for IELTS. Your main purpose is to get bands in IELTS. The spin-off would be improvement in English. That's not what you expected, but you also got an improvement in English. I'm just making a very weak example, but just to get an an unexpected but useful result of an activity that is designed to produce something else. That's a spin-off. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. More moving back. Um, okay. Uh, advent. What does advent mean? It's a common word and I want you to know this word. Advent. Introduction of something. Yes. In Hindi, it's, it will be Agman. Agman. Yes. Coming. With the coming of something. Perfect meaning. Uh, advent coming of starting of something with the beginning of something. So... How do I use this word? I use this word in writing when I want to talk about with the advent of internet. So I, I talk about things like that. With the advent of internet, communication has become very easy. Communication has become a lot easier. That's how I use this word. I use this word in my writing. Okay, acquisition. What does acquisition mean? And you know the word, it, it starts. Uh, Yes. What you acquire, what you have. No, what you have, no. What you acquire, acquire, yes. Right, yeah. Yeah, acquire. To, um, if I want to say it in Hindi, hasil karna kuch, to get something. That's acquisition. Acquisition of this. Indigenous, that's a word, that's a good word and that you should know. It's reused in readings. Indigenous. Indigenous. Uh, sir, Andishwas, Andishwas, to... No. Internal. Uh, internal is very Inside. close. Inside, it's very close. But the exact meaning, indigenous. Local people of Australia? Uh, not Australia. Local people. Just local. Uh, local, local people. Indigenous means uh, native, native from that area. Native. Yeah. Right. So if I want to clarify how this is used, for example, if I say this is an indigenous mobile phone, that means it, it was not imported from other countries. It was made in India. Indigenous means from your own country, from your own region, not imported from somewhere else. It can be used for local people also. Indigenous people means the people from that region, not foreigners. So indigenous means from that area. Yes, uh, indigenous. That's the meaning. That's the word. Um, okay, let's start with the reading because it's already fixed in. We'll, um, we'll start. Can you hear me? The, the connection was unstable. Uh, can you hear me now? Yes, yes. Yes, since it's okay. Okay, moving. Um, let's start with the questions. So the first few questions are headings. Uh, the paragraph E is done. So whenever I start headings, the first thing I look at is whether the options can be repeated or not. That's what's going in my head. So I looked here. The options cannot be repeated. There is no instruction on whether the option can be repeated. If this instruction is not men me uh, mentioned, then you cannot repeat. For example, um, if one paragraph has X, 10th heading, no other paragraph can have the 10th heading. So the options cannot be repeated. That's my first task that I look at. After that, it's just reading three, four lines and try trying to guess the meaning. So now I'm going to go back. I'm going to read three lines. I'm going to understand what the those three lines are saying. And then I'm going to mark the relevant option. I'm not going to read the whole thing. Just the three lines. So let's do it. First paragraph, A paragraph. We'll all read it together. I'll read it, then I'll ask you what, it, what is said. And please remember, I read very slowly because I, that's how I read in the paper as well. I'm not reading slowly for you. I'm very slow. I do it slowly, but I do it properly. Okay. Rocket technology has progressed. Your Con connection is not good, sir. Not good? Okay. Yes, uh, sometimes it is breaking. Wait, sir, your voice. Yes, sir. <laughs> My voice is breaking up. 
Yeah. Sometimes your voice is too breaking, sir. Now okay. it's clear, sir. And okay. now it's okay. Now it's okay. Uh, let me know if, if it breaks again. I'll uh, I'll change my location. I okay. have an internet connection. I'll change the connection as well. Okay. Is it okay now? Now it's okay. Yes, sir. Yes, now better. Okay. So I'm going to read the first three lines and I'm going to read them properly. Then let's see what heading I des uh, decide. Okay. Rocket technology has progressed considerably since the days of fire arrows. So this technology rockets have progressed considerably since the days of fire arrows. First used in China around 500 BC. So these were also rockets. The fire arrows were also rockets. But now they've progressed significantly. They have now progressed a lot and during the Song Dynasty to repel Mongol invaders. So they are talking about the first use of rockets. The first use of rockets was long back in 500 BC, but the rocket technology has progressed off a lot. These ancient rockets stand in stark contrast to the present day Chinese rocket launch vehicles. So these rockets, the rockets way back in 500 BC, they're very different. Stark contrast means very different to the present day rockets. That's what I, what it is saying. I don't think there's anything else in this line. So they are talking about the history of rockets. The, uh, the uh, rockets in the past are completely different from rockets today. That's what it's saying here in these two lines. Nothing else is worth reading. So I'll go and look at the options now. Okay. So Western countries, no talk about Western countries, leave it. Different levels of development, no. Factors determining the development of space technology. I did not even read the word space technology. An ancient invention and its current application. This could be an answer. An ancient invention because it was very ancient, 500 BC, and even its current application. So current, it's being used in space uh, launch vehicles. Military aspects of satellites, no. Rocket application in ancient China. Yeah. This could also yeah. come. So I could have the answer as fourth. I could also have uh, sixth. The impact and future scope of space-based technologies. I don't think this is the answer. Non-technology factors count. No. Competitive edge gained by more economically feasible satellites. No. no. The focus on remote sensing. No. So nothing else makes sense to me. The only two options that make sense to me is fourth and sixth. Now I want to choose one. So here it's talking about an ancient invention. And it's also saying its current application, its current use. But in the sixth option, it's only talking about rocket application in ancient China. So if if it's if it's if there's a mention of current application, current means today in today's era, then I'll go with the fourth option. If it only talks about ancient China, then I'll go with the sixth option. I'll read carefully. I think it did talk about current also. If you if you read it, means these ancient rockets stand in stark contrast to the present-day Chinese rocket launch vehicles called the Long March, intended to place a Chinese astronaut in space by 2005. So it's talking mm -hmm. about the current application also, an ancient technology and its current application. So I'll go with the fourth option and not the sixth option. Is it clear, my thinking? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Dharman, is it clear for you? Why fourth? Yes, sir. Okay, going forward. Now you will do it. I'll make one person read it. Uh, uh, who wants to go? Who, who wants to read the second paragraph? Anyone? Paragraph B? So myself, sir. Okay, Santosh, go ahead. B paragraph. After the this... Space... Yes. Okay. Go ahead, go ahead. The space age has had dramatic effect worldwide with the direct development in space technology influencing telecommunications, meteorological forecasting, okay. earth resource. Wait, 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 Santosh. So you don't need to name all them, but you know now what the paragraph, yes. what, what is it trying to tell me? So read that, but don't don't read all of them. You got an idea, but what is it, what is it saying? The first three lines. Tell me that. Try to get the concept. So space age has dramatic. Dramatic means what? It's unimaginable. Unimaginable, huge, yes, huge yes. impacts. Um, huge impact, yes. yes. On what? In worldwide and in everywhere. In yes, our... in everything. So they have, they have the space age has a huge impact on every field of life. That's what it's saying. Perfect answer. Let's move to the next line. Yes. In disaster migration. Here, new one. for uh, new one innovation innovative uses for satellites are constantly being 
explored with potential revolutionary effects such okay. as in a field of health and telemedicine same thing sir they, they continue once again they, they told that about the what are the benefits they get from the space age sir yes good so the the benefits in different fields of space age right yes sir yes, sir okay okay so now you are going to read the options and you are going to tell me which option suits the best sure sure sir okay first option yes or no western countries provide essential assistance can it be an so option no sir no go ahead no, no sir different levels of development within asia no sir no factors determining the development of space technology in asia yes the third one sometimes sir sometimes but uh, it wasn't it, about asia it was about the whole world oh, yes, sir, yes, sir. so i don't want to mark this and factors de determining the development no it was the okay, okay. It was the sectors not the factors sure, oh, fine 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 sir yes an ancient fourth one is not one sir fifth one is also not one sir sixth no so sixth one is also not one the impact on future scope is based technologies yeah sixth one sir so yes. it's the seventh sorry seventh one seventh one okay. so let's just confirm if future is given for the future if future the second scope. line was in future we'll just confirm that otherwise i also think the seventh one would be the correct option okay fine fine sir. fine so we'll just confirm we'll talk about the future scope yes um yes so tell me what's the word here there's a word for future which is that word new and innovative new and innovative uses for satellite constantly being explored sir continuously it's happening with next the second word. line sir. constantly being explored with potential revolutionary yes, this is the word potential potential is what the scope for future so for example we say it has great potential great potential is something related to future meaning future. it can become future. very big in the future so potential is a word that makes you make makes it show that it also also talking about future and yes the way you read it you are clear that even the sentence formation is in present tense but it is talking about the future so yes, is, is 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 it clear for everyone yes sir okay. it's very clear okay now uh someone raised their hand uh sahil i don't remember someone raised their hand uh who was that excuse me sir yes Sir, being also indicate the future uh, tense. Which yeah. one? Being. Being. Yeah. being means it's happening right now. Being doesn't mean future. Being means it's happening right now. For example, um, the class is being taken by me. So this is mean. This means uh, right now. What is happening? Right now. It, it is not related yeah. to future. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Someone, uh, Sahil. Uh, someone said they want to raise. Someone raised. Yes, sir. I can. Uh, you can, but someone else raised their hand first. I want to give them the opportunity because they raised their hand, but they're no not. No problem. No, wait. Just hold on. If they're there, let me check. Uh, Santosh, you raised your hand. I know, but someone else did. Okay. Um. Uh. Someone. Uh, the person who called, who spoke up, you can read. Yes, sir. Yes. Go ahead. Asian. Nations have been particularly eager to embrace this development. Okay, tell the, the last mean, meaning of this line. Then we move ahead. So, Asian nations have been particularly eager means they are doing uh, particularly eager to their developments and they are um, what embracing the eager. They have been eager. What is eager? So they are uh, very much eager that uh, they have to. I don't get it. That's that word. Curious. Curious. Yes, sir. Not nearly so curious. No, eager means can't wait to do something. Oh. For example, I can't wait. I can't wait for my. Uh, I'm very eager for for the new car. मतलब I can't wait. I'm so excited. You're so excited for something. You can't wait for it. It's very difficult for you to wait because you're so excited. That's eager. So Asian nations can't wait. They're very active. They're very uh, excited. To embrace, embrace means what? Implement. No. Gali no. lagan like. What else? Increase, Show increase. No. Showcase. Embrace is fine. Yes, I'll I'll tell Come you the name. meaning of embrace. Embrace. Gali lagan. Apnaana. What? What again? What? 
अपनाना इन हिंदी Asian nations have been particular. They are very eager. They can't wait. They are very excited about these new. They are very excited about these developments. Which developments? Which is the what developments did we talk about in the last paragraph? Developments in which field? Space. Space. Yes, sir. Space. Space technologies. Yes, space. Okay, got it. Next, let's go next. Read next. In the, in the last decade, there has been a dramatic growth in space activities in Asia. both in the utilization of space based service and the production of satellites and launchers okay what meaning of this line so um, there has been a dramatic growth in um, so in the last decade there was a um, uh, dramatic growth means uh, uh, very surprising or huge growth yes in, growth. in space activities In Asia. In, in Asia, Asia, you got the meaning. Asia में बहुत ज़्यादा Asia में बहुत. Yes, there was a huge growth. Yes, ठीक है. One more line and then we'll look at the meanings. Ah, uh, look at the headings. One more line. This rapid expansion has led many commentators and analysts to predict that Asia will become a world space power. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Okay. People are thinking that Asia will become a world power in space technologies. Yes, sir. World power mean there'll be a leader. Okay, so let's look at the options. You're going to tell me the correct option now. Read carefully, slowly. That's it. Okay, go. First option. Western countries provide essential assistance. No, sir. No, good. Different Thanks. levels of development within Asia. Mm, no, sir. No, good. Factors determining the development of space technology in Asia. Yes, sir. These options can which, be. Which which factors did you read? Which factors are determining the development of space? Can you name one factor that we read? Yes or no? That's it. No. 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 Then why are you marking third? Leave it now. It can be third, but you should not be marking it because you did not read any factors. Leave yes, this. Sir. Next. An ancient invention and its current. No, sir. No. Military aspects of satellites, rocket application in Asian China, the impact and future scope of space-based technology, non-technology factors count, competitive edge gained by more economically feasible satellites. Sir, this can be competitive edge gained by more economically feasible. Economically feasible means cheap. We did not yes, think about price. that the technology is cheap or not so i don't no. think this can happen but yes and what else tenth the focus on remote sensing technologies no right so yes sir non technology right. factors count uh, okay so we did not find any okay sorry we did not find any answer sorry yes, there's sir. a lot of disturbance uh so we'll read further we will not try to mark an answer we'll read further we did not find anything why not read two three more lines because we did not get the meaning from here we did not get a good heading from here so we'll read next go uh continue if the disturbance is fine continue go yes sir space in asia is very much influenced by the competitive commercial space sector the emergence of low cost mini satellites and the globalization of industrial and financial markets okay so meaning of, is, meaning of this line factors are these right? so these factors are the factors are can we see three factors competitive commercial emergence yes, of cost, the emergence of low cost mini satellites and the globalization so we write how many factors three factors three right factors yes yeah. sir so now you can name the factors factors have started okay you can read further or we can we can mark the answer we think the factor the answer is correct now yes sir okay so we will mark the factors answer now because if we have come across the three factors factors determining the development of space technology in asia is it clear for everyone yes sir yes sir so if you don't find your answer don't don't be in a rush to mark something read further that's my advice here okay you can read one more sentence 
and we are not reading everything. So whatever you read, you're going to read slowly and properly. You're not going to hurry past anything. Okay, next option, D paragraph. Uh, someone else with D? For D. Anyone wants to read D paragraph? Listen. Okay, so Nanda, you can read. Go. Okay. At present, uh, three Asian nations, Japan, China, and India have comprehensive end-to-end -end space capabilities and possess uh, a complete space infrastructure. Space technology, satellites, manufacturing, rockets, and space ports. Okay, meaning of this so, line. Yes. Like it's, it is saying as like at present that three countries like Japan, China, and India has uh, have comprehensive. These countries have capabilities to uh, complete a space infrastructure in space technologies. Okay, okay. what does comprehensive and end to end mean? Can anyone tell? Comprehensive, me? comprehensive like complete. Yes, that's it. End to end also means complete. So they have complete technologies. They are not lagging behind any other countries. They have all the technology needed. Three nations, three mm -hmm. Asian countries, Japan, China, and India, complete India. space technology. Okay, first line is done. Next. Okay. Japan is regarded as the dominant space power in Asia, and its, its record of success and quality of technologies are equal to those of the West. So okay. here they, they, are asked, uh, they are saying like that the, Japan is not in number one like they have, Okay, that's it. Uh, Japan is the best. Okay, next. Yes, Japan is the best. Okay, uh, in view of the technological uh, challenges and high risk involved in the space activities, a very long and expensive learning curve has been followed to obtain those success achieved. Japan. Okay. So, do I need to read more? Okay, we'll try to mark from this much. Okay, so what did you get? Are you clear? Yes, so sir. they're talking about three countries uh, that they have complete technologies in Asia. And these countries mm -hmm. are what? Japan, China, and India. And then India. Yeah. And, and then Japan the... has in the number one who have the... Uh, like... Yes. Yeah. Anch, do you have a doubt? Okay. Okay, fine. Okay, so we'll read. Now let's read the options. Okay, Sananda. Mm -hmm. so, okay. First one. Western countries provide essential. So here they are talking about Asians, not Western. Yes. I think so. Uh, different levels of development within Asia. It could be the answer because uh, here uh, in different levels, each, uh, the paragraph was talking about the different uh, areas like Asia's country. Okay. So first, um, it, talk, first it, it talks about which three countries have complete technologies. Japan. Uh, the India, China, and Japan. So read later. If there are other countries which have less technology, then we'll say this is the correct answer because then it would mean okay. different levels of development. Different levels of development. Okay, so okay. let's read further. If there are other countries in Asia which have less... Like, sir, so scroll down. Okay, okay, okay scroll. I'll scroll down. Okay. So uh, from I'll start from... Yeah. Here, just find a country. Okay. South Korea is... Huh. Okay. South Korea is currently attempting to join Japan, China, and India within with its plans to develop a launch site at Spaceport. Additionally, nations in Southeast, Southeast Asia, as well as those bordering the Indian subcontinent, Nepal, Pakistan, and Bangladesh. So these uh, three countries also added in this. Have yes, they, are, they are starting to develop, and they are starting to develop. So, to develop. Yes. So did you find different levels of development? India, yes, China, and Japan, very developed. Yes, these countries are starting to develop. So your answer is confirmed now. So you can mark yes, the answer sir. as second. Second. Is it clear for everyone how did how we did this? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes. Okay. Next, someone wants to read or I'll uh, give it uh, someone. E paragraph is done. Someone else wants to read. Someone new or I'll give it to someone else. Anksh, okay. Go ahead, read F paragraph. Anksh, go. You're muted. Yes. So, uh, F paragraph. Yes, F paragraph. A is already done. Okay, so in recent years, there have been fundamental changes in the way satellites are designed and built to drastically reduce cost. The emergence of wait, the small wait, wait, wait. Sorry. Of this line. Then we go next. We find one key point, sir. Reduced costs economically. Yeah. So in recent years, there have been, so they are being designed to reduce costs. First point is about reducing costs. 
Is it okay? I'll start the yes, Okay, next. Go ahead. Anj. The emergence of the small satellites and their quick adoption by the Asian countries as a way to develop low-cost satellites technology and rapidly establish a space capability has given these countries the more possibility the possibility to shorten their learning cure by the decade or more the okay. globe increase of technology understand the meaning you tell me the meaning now you read this line you read too much read less and understand what does this line say so again emergence of which kind of satellites coming of which kind of satellites small the emergence small small so now they have small satellites and they have been quickly adopted by who, which countries? Asian. So Asian the countries. Asian countries. Yes. And they have found a way to develop what? Low, low cost. cost satellite. So again, it is talking about they have found a way to develop low cost technology. Even the first paragraph, of first line was about low cost. Even the second yes, line is about low costs. Okay. So we are getting an idea. This paragraph is about how Asian countries are reducing what? The cost of satellites and how satellites. it is using them. Okay, so let's try to find a, a good answer. Okay, first, Anj. Western, uh, Western countries provide a essential assistance. Can it be the answer or no? So, no. No. So the answer is nine, sir. Ninth, competitive edge gained by more economically feasible. Economically the ninth. Yes. So economically, economically cheap. Yes. So because it is talking about that a cost. Yes. That which they have adapted. Yes. And now they have become competitive. Now competitive in what sense? Asian countries are producing what? Cheap satellites at low cost. So they are giving a competition to which countries? The Western countries. So we'll find that competition part also. See, in the very last line. Did you find competitive? May very well result in a highly competitive Asian satellite. Manufacturing industries. So you can yeah. confirm your answer here. So you read about cost and you also found competitive industry. The low costs are yeah. making it competitive. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. It's very clear. Okay. So, so the answer is nine. Yeah, the answer is nine. We, we even ensured our answer. We are sure now. Very sure. Sir. Okay. Moving to 33rd to 36th. Yes, uh, someone asked me a sentence completion. So I picked these. Yesterday, someone asked me for sentence completion questions. So I especially pick these. So someone else wants to go. How do I do them? I'll do one question, then you'll do the rest. I'll show you one question. Experts experts okay. believe that Asia will become the world space power. Actually, I remember where I read this. Do you remember? Yeah, we read something. Yes. I, I think we read this in the second paragraph or third paragraph. No. I don't remember. Third, it was third C, I think. C, C paragraph. C paragraph? Yeah. China, India, and also Japan. Yeah, yeah. This rapid expansion has led many com commentators and analysts to predict that Asia will become a world space power. So I remembered. See, that's why I tell you to read properly. I, I remembered because I read it properly. So I remembered. This rapid expansion, which rapid expansion, I'll read it properly. Rapid expansion in what? In utilization of space-based services and the production of satellites and launchers. So it is talking about the production of satellite and the utilization of space. So there would be something like this. So let me try to mark the answer now. Uh, I know what it is about. Okay. So I'll check. Because it can help observe the crops. Nothing about crops. Because there are some unapproachable areas. Nothing about unapproachable areas. No. Because of the rapid expansion of space technologies in Asia. It's the right answer. I read this answer. Is it clear for everyone? Asia rapid. With rapid expansion. That's what we read there, right? Rapid expansion of space technologies in Asia. Mm -hmm. I'll show it again, Dharman. Wait. Okay. Okay. But I have. You you okay. could not see rapid expansion. Yes, here. There has been the rapid. This rapid expansion has led many commentators. Ah, completely okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And even here, we found there has been a dramatic growth. Dramatic growth is also nothing but also, rapid. Yeah, it's expansion, yeah. Is it clear for everyone how I did this? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, moving forward yes, to the next sir. question. Okay, someone else now? The next question, 30, 34th. 
Anyone else? You can volunteer. Yes, sir. May I read it? Yeah, for those. Go ahead. Uh, 34. Development of satellite technology in Asian countries may be limited. Okay. So uh, what would be our approach? The same paragraph I read some limited word there. Limited. The what does limited mean? Uh, yeah. Limited Please means uh, very few yes, or very few. Restricted means it would restricted, be restricted. Yes. Yeah. It would be obstruction. There would be difficulties in it. So mm. we have to find there would be difficulties now. Okay. So let's try to find. So you found limited in C paragraph. Yeah. So some, C paragraph. Some C paragraph, and you can tell me. Okay. You can look at yeah. it. Uh, there are uh, three factors. You have written three factors. Uh, yeah. Just. Uh, moreover, in the development of these technology, many non-technical factors such as economics, politics, culture, and history interact and play important roles, which in turn might limit space technology in Asia. Okay, perfect. So you found the answer. So now they are saying there will be non-technical factors which will limit space technology in Asia. And that's what you read. Yeah. Yes. yes. So let's look at the options. You tell me the answer. Let, let her do it first. Okay. Okay, then we'll help her if uh, if she needs help. Okay. First, because it can help observe no crops, no. Because there are some unapproachable areas. Uh, this can be because of the, because of the influence of other non-technical factors. Because of easy no. I think it is a D. Yeah. Because of the influence of other non-technical factors. Same, the same sentence. Okay, we'll confirm it again. Um, I, I D also think it's D, but I'll read D it again. D or B. D or B. Maybe. D or B, D just, D you D confirm D it. I'll leave it here. Yeah. You confirm it now. D. Okay. So it's D. D. It's D, oh. non-technical oh. factors. Okay, good. Is it clear for everyone? Yeah. This was easy. Right? Um, these questions are easy. The whole reading is, has been easy. 35th. Anyone else? Anyone wants to do 35th? Okay. Okay. Um, no one? Dhaman, go ahead. Uh, I will go. But 35th. 35th. Yes. Uh, remote sensing has received a lot of focus in Asia and Southeast Asia. It means both in Asia. Southeast Asia. and Southeast Asia. Okay. And which technology? Remote sensing. Okay. So let's try to find remote sensing. Yeah, remote sensing. Okay. Um, let's, I'll start from the D paragraph because I don't think it's in D, C. D, D, in D, D. Okay. ASEAN, Japan, China, India have completed the remote sensing. Remote sensing I haven't seen here. Okay. Should I move ahead? A little, please. Um, I haven't seen here remote sensing. No, it's not. No, it's not in this paragraph. Uh, yeah, remote sensing here is present. Okay. So yeah, I found it. Okay. Yeah, I will read from that's a, a little down, please, a little. I should treat from the first. Asia, okay. South Asia in particular, suffer from a long list of recurring large scale environmental problems, including the storm and flooding. It is already said about disaster, forest fires, and deforestation and crop failure, all of disaster. Thus, the space of application that has attracted the most attention in this region is remote sensing. Okay, remote sensing satellite equipped with. I think you got the answer already. Think. Yeah. Yeah, it means that they, all of them is using for disaster management. 
Yes. So Asian South Asia are using it for disaster management. Okay. Perfect yeah. answer. Now let's try to match the options. Okay. Because it can help observe the groups. It can be, but it's not the main things because there are some unapproachable area. It's not because of rapid expansion of the space. It's not because of the influence over that. Not, not because of easily accessible commercial satellite equipment. No, because our show is prone to many natural. Yeah, if, if it's correct. Is it clear for everyone? <clears throat> yeah, government perfect. Thank you, sir. Okay, satellite manufacturing, last one. We have already done this. Do you remember this? Uh, yes. Which sir. paragraph? Which paragraph? 36 F, F, F competitive F in the last line yeah so let's read why so you can all tell me why this much let's read this much this is one line so what, what are the reasons uh, the global increase of technology transfer mechanisms so there has been an increase of technology transfer meaning countries are transferring their technologies one country to another and the use of readily available, readily means nothing but easily available. Readily means easily. You don't have to order something. It's already readily available in the market. Readily available commercial technologies to replace costly space and military standard components may very well result in a highly competitive Asian satellite manufacturing industry. So they have given two reasons. One is technology transfer. And second is easily available commercial technology. These are the two reasons why Asia might become highly competitive. Let's mark the options now, correct option. Uh, ob crops, no. Unapproachable areas, no. It's the E option. E e option. Easily accessible commercial satellite equipment. I think that's the correct answer. Is it clear for everyone? Yes. Yes, huh? sir. Okay. Let's do last uh, four. 37th. Um, so, so, can someone tell me my method? Deepak, can you explain my method in English? English? Okay, I'll explain it. So, how do I do these questions? I make false beforehand. So, I'll make a false. I'll think how it would be false. So, let me do one for you. Ancient China had already deployed rockets for military purpose as early as 500 BC. So, they had done rockets for military purpose as early as 500 BC. So they were using rockets for military purpose in 500 BC. If they were using rockets for military purpose in 500 BC, our answer would be true. If they were not using it for military purpose in that time, or they were not using it then at that time, they were using after 500 BC, my answer would be false. If they were doing it 500 BC and 500 BC, my answer would be true. So let's find out if they were doing it in 500 BC or they did that later. So... Coming to here, come. It's the first paragraph. You're going to tell me the right answer. You're going to read it and tell me the right answer. The answer has to be in these lines only. So, may I read? Yes, so it's around 500. It's yes. not used for military. Around is not the around is not an issue. Okay. Rocket technology has progressed considerably. Anyone can tell me, read and tell me the answer. Think about your answer. You read this much again, understand what's given here and tell me whether it's false, true or not given. So were they using, rockets in, were they using rockets in 500 BC? First tell me this or not. No, yes, sir. no or yes? No. No. Yes, sir. Yes, they were sir. using rockets uh, since the days of fire arrows first used in china around 500 bc yeah, it's yeah true. So they were using they were using in the form of fire arrows rockets fire arrows are nothing but rockets in their opinion and they, they, were, they were using it now what's the question let's read the question again properly they were using fire arrows let's read it they were talk, using technology ro rockets the question is saying Ancient China had already deployed rockets for military purpose. They were using rockets for military. Now, okay. this part, we don't know for sure. We'll read it again. So, were they using rockets for military purpose as early as 500 BC? So, let's read it again. Uh, because it is around, not early. No, that's not the reason. Around and early, as early as, as early as means from that time. Very long back. That's it. 
Not around is the same thing. The, the question is not before 500 BC. As early as means so long back. Okay. Um, so let's read. Were they using arrows and that 500 BC for military purpose or not? Tell me this. No, so it's not mentioned. It's not yes, sir. Yes, so sir. not given. It's so given. It's given. Where? Gun forward. Uh, during Gun the forward. Song Dynasty to repel Mongol invaders. At the Battle of? Uh, Kaifan. In... Yeah. But this is a different time, right? Yeah. Mm, what different. about in 500 BC? 500 BC, you don't know whether they were using for military purpose or some other purpose. So what would be your answer? Not, not given. given. Not, not given. Not given. Not given. Are you clear with this? A very confusing question, but the answer is going to be not given because we don't know whether they were used for military purpose or not. Is it clear for uh, everyone now, this question? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Good. Uh, moving forward, next question. This one, okay. How it would be false? Uh, Fidos, you tell me how this would be false. 38. Based technology, yes. Uh, enhance, ka oppos uh, there can be a word opposite to enhance. Like What does enhance mean? Uh, to improve. Yes, and what would be the opposite? Uh, mm, something reduced the literacy reduced or made no change would that also no be change. Yes. made no change okay so let's see if space technology in improved literacy or not if it improved lit literacy our answer would be true if true. it didn't make any change it would not reduce right space technology how would it be reduced but if it no it made no change to literacy our answer would be false and false. if there is no link given between space technology lit and literacy, uh, literacy yeah. our answer would be not given Okay, so I'll show you the paragraph and you can tell me the answer. Um, we'll start with the B paragraph first. Does it talk about literacy? First, try to find that. Is there anything, is there anything related to education? So distance education, distance yeah. education. Distance but distance it does education. not mention literacy whether literacy, literacy so. yes so we'll it will be not given it yeah uh, from here but we'll read one more here, yes yes Nothing. It's not given. Even, not, not given. Sir. Even I have a feeling it's not given. Uh, okay. So we'll mark it as not given. But we'll confirm it when we do the next question. So we'll know for sure not given. If the next question is here, then we know it's not given because we have read till here. But if the next question is an F paragraph, then we'll have to read D and E as well. Okay. 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 So let's go and read the next question. Um, 39th. Remote sense satellite imaging can help in natural disaster prevention and surveillance. Remote satellite imaging was in which paragraph? D. Last paragraph. No, not la E. 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 Paragraph. e paragraph. So we'll have to read D also for that question. So read D for literacy because you might have missed the answer. So let's read D for literacy. Anything till now about literacy? No, sir. Okay. No, sir. No, moving forward. From Japan, you can read now. Remote sensing is not here. No, we are finding about literacy again because remote ah. sensing was an E. So we're just making sure there's nothing about literacy in D paragraph. Just to okay. be sure. Literacy, what I haven't seen in this paragraph. So Association of Southeast Asian. Yeah, that's the name of a name of a body, Association of Southeast Asian Nations. 
So it's just an organization. Nothing about um, education. Yes, so, sir. Okay. So nothing. So we'll mark it as not given. We are sure not. Given, yeah. Okay. So uh, remote sensing. Now let's find out remote sensing. Now uh, let me read the remote sensing question once more because I forgot it. Remote sensing imaging can help in natural disaster prevention and surveillance. Actually, he read, read that part only. Um, I think. How can it help? Is it given anywhere? In the first line. In the first line. Any sensing satellite equipped with instrument to take photographs of the ground at different yeah. variables, provide essential information for natural yeah. resource accounting, environmental management, disaster prevention. prevention. Disaster prevention came here, so we'll make sure remote sensing is helping in disaster prevention. So we got the answer. Let's see if it that's the same thing. I think it's it's supposed to be true. Yeah, it's a surveillance so true. prevention. What does surveillance mean? Anyone? Surveillance to keep a watch. Observation. Yeah. To bring some data, to collect data. No, uh, yeah, observation. Yeah. A watch. Yeah. Observe, observing something. Okay. Um, good. Um, I want to tell you one point in an essay. There's a there's an essay. Why do criminals after coming out of prisons why do they commit crime again and again so there are many criminals who after living leaving prisons commit crime and one of my solu solutions to, to that problem is to have a surveillance police surveillance on ex-criminals because we know they commit crime so we should keep a surveillance on them so i'm just telling you a solution it's a solution that we don't ordinarily think so surveillance means watch so we should keep a surveillance on ex-criminals people who have committed crime before if we want to uh, prevent them from committing crimes. So just giving you a point. Okay, 40th. Um, this answer you know, tell me. No, it's wrong. It's wrong. It's, do you it's remember possible. everyone? Yeah. It yes, sir. Unlikely. Yeah, it is unlikely. Last paragraph said what? The in Asia will be able to compete in satellite because of low cost and everything. But the paragraph says Asia will, uh, it is unlikely. Unlikely means? Not expected to. Yeah, Perfect. Not, Perfect. Not expected. Good chance. Not expected. Low Less chance. Chances. Yes. Not a low chance. Yes. Or low chances. So it is unlikely that Asia will, able, will be able to compete. But the paragraph, last paragraph says, uh, may very well result, may very well result in a highly competitive Asian satellite manufacturing industry. That's true. Yeah, so the answer is opposite. So the answer would be false or no, uh, false. So is it clear for everyone? Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Okay, so that's how I think. I do. Yes. My class. Yeah, it's your class. Okay, you can con continue and you can put the message once more in the group for all okay. the students. Okay. Okay, I'll... Uh, I'll um, I'll close the class here and I'll you you want to start again? What do you want to do? I'll end the class and then you do it because otherwise the recording would be too too large. Okay.